1986. It was an eventful year. The average household income was just under 23 grand. A new Mustang off the lot was eight grand. A gallon of gas for that Mustang was just 89 cents. And Michael Jackson was still black. Games were on the rise. Great bands were releasing music, such as Cryptic Slaughter's Convicted. The only band I know to ever get signed to Metal Blade Records and Relapse. Arguably two of the best metal labels of all time. I mean, just look at these kids. I really envy them for thriving in this time period. But it wasn't all sunshine and roses. 86 was also the year of the Chernobyl explosion. But even worse than the radiation that wiped out a piece of Europe was the piece of shit game Karate Champs for the NES. 86 was a big year for karate. Hell, the entire 80s karate was so big, it's arguably equally as big as the UFC is today. People also regarded it as a super effective method for self-defense. There's no doubt that it would spread to gaming. Unfortunately, it spread like AIDS in this instance, which is also pretty characteristic of 1986. Karate Champ, known in Japan as Karate Do, or Way of the Empty Hand, is a 1984 arcade fighting game developed by Technos Japan and released by Data East. A variety of moves can be performed using the dual joystick controls for using a best of three match format like later fighting games. The game was a major commercial success, both for arcades and home computers. Karate Champ established and popularized the one-on-one -on -one fighting game genre, meaning there would potentially be no Tekken or Street Fighter without a game like this. It was released on several platforms, including arcade machines, Apple II, Commodore 64, and it even got a port on the fucking iPhone in 2010. The NES and Commodore port are the worst ones, heavily criticized for their unresponsive controls and terrible hit detection. The arcade version is the one everyone praises and still enjoys to this day. But enough about 86. Let's play this fucking game. Right off the bat, the music is pretty good. Hell, it's way better than the arcade version, which has a high-pitched dog whistle in the fucking song. The sprites look like Italian guys, and the referee looks like Miss Crabtree from South Park. The controls are the most unresponsive trash you could ever experience in a video game. It takes up to like three seconds sometimes to randomly to hit again, and I'm playing with an Xbox One controller and an emulator. It shouldn't be like that. It's not like that with the movement keys, so I'm beginning to think the lag between hits was intentional to make the game more difficult, or it was just programmed shitty. Probably just programmed like shit. What is he doing, man? Why? Why? Why do you not punch, you fucking fuck? The game uses a best of three format, but like, the middle round only gives you half a point, so I still don't understand how the fuck the point system works. I'll win four in a row, and we still can be tied if the other guy wins two on the full point rounds, so I don't really get it. Spamming punch is the best way to make it through the earlier rounds, but even then it's still random. If you do something experimental like manage to change your direction, you can't change it back and you're fucked. This game is the worst thing Asians has made since the bird flu. The knockouts are so spontaneous you can punch the asshole in the face like 11 times and he can counter you randomly with the exact same ability one time. Imagine f the flash knockouts in UFC video games, only it's every round and it never works in your favor. Only the other dickheads. And guess what happens if you lose a match? The game resets and you gotta start from round one. Thank God this isn't the arcade version and this game didn't siphon cores with its overly consequential mechanics cause this is some bullfuck. You beat each round, you're greeted with flower pots because I guess this has a lot to do with karate. Some of them clear your head perfectly, some you can jump over easily, but there's one that you can't jump over or duck under, and it's literally humanly impossible to fucking clear. One. How? You can't jump under it or duck under it. It doesn't even make fucking sense. I mean, really, what a shitty minigame. In the arcade version, you fight a bull, and also you get a girl after each shitty you beat. Where the fuck is my girl, and where the fuck is my bull? This is bullshit. Once you make it to a certain round, the guy figures out your shit, and you can no longer spam the A button. It sucks you have to fight him legit because it's impossible. The game is so fucked you can't develop a non-cheesable strategy in order to win. You have to cheese it. Luckily, there's one more I found out you can do. 
Jumping 100% triggers your opponent to also jump, which then leaves him open for a counter when he does a low kick. But you really got to pull it off clean because a lot of times he can just kick your ass out of midair like a fucking spider monkey. Oh, oh no. Oh. I, it's how? Luckily, these. D no. No. That was the last level of the game. There's no credits. No, co it restarts. And I fight the same fucking asshole again? No, it can't be. I'm gonna make sure. And I'm gonna beat this guy. No. The game just resets at an increased difficulty. No congrats, no credits, no girls, no nothing. Why? I even beat the first round again to make sure, but it's literally nothing. How could they do this to a kid actually willing to beat this piece of shit? And they even put the mini game in again to fuck with you all over. Yeah, fuck this. I'm kicking some ass. All right, time for me to hop in here and kick some fucking ass. Yeah, get your ass whooped. And that's one hit. Yep. Point for the whites. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Hey. Yeah, 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 yeah. Victory. What's up with it? What's up with it? All right, we got that plant shit. Okay, I'm a number one jumper. Oh, wait. Your ass, can, your ass is punching him? What the fuck? Hold up. Yeah, I cleared that one. Okay. All right, I'm, I'm out of here, dude. Fuck this shit. Subscribe to the fucking, uh, yeah, Discord, uh, Instagram, Reddit, yeah, donate some money, hey, there's the, there's the Reddit.